everyone. I got a few questions about how I have put different types of files, including AR, into the app Freeform. So I thought I would take you through that now. I've made a sample board just here as a template for where I'm going to place different file types. The first one I want to start with is how you would bring things from the web or specifically from Google for students to use. So I'm going to demo that now. I've got a link already copied to the clipboard. So we go up to our media option, link, paste the link, and here we have the file. You can resize. You can also turn off the constrained proportions, depending on how you want it to appear for your students, and then easily move it around. Now for bringing different file types in, with some of the apps on iPad, you can easily drag and drop, but as a better workflow, I like to come up again to the media option and choose insert from. I've put together just a few different samples of different file types, which I'm going to go ahead and bring in. This one is a, I believe it's a keynote file. There we go. Again, you can resize as needed. Let's do that again now for the next one. An audio sample that was made in voice memos. There we go. Another one, this time a book creator template. Again, resize as needed. And the last one is going to be the AR file. There we go. Very, very simple. You can add extra details on as needed with instructions for students, but I really like this use of Freeform for organizing a lot of different files into one single source of truth for students. I think it would be really helpful for teachers to look at the use of Freeform uh, when they are working with students, especially if you can um, make use of your managed Apple IDs if you have them and collaborate with students, giving them view access uh, to collaborate on this file so that they have a single source of truth for all of the different file types they're going to need. And again, this can be a, an ongoing resource that you keep adding to. As you can see, there's still so much more space that we could build upon. But at least this gives students a nice tool to keep coming back to to access the different files that they're going to need. So I hope that was helpful.